Hey guys, what's going on? Uh, real quickly today, I just want to go over some stuff in the markets that I think are being overlooked in a way that you can capitalize when the markets are kind of going on a downturn. So a lot of people freak out when they see the queues, Facebook, all this stuff dropping. But I'm telling you right now, if you're looking at the markets, this is the perfect time to stand by and get ready for a really big upswing. So small caps have been really, really slow lately, which really sucks because that's where a lot of the volatility is at. However, when you look at the large caps, with the volatility we're seeing there with these big drops, options are gonna be your best bet moving forward. Now, you don't have to take big size, you can play small, but what you wanna wait for is a rebound and basing on the QQQ, the NASDAQ, and the SPY. Once you see those first couple of green days start to base, you can start looking at Facebook, Apple, Nvidia, these are all stocks that are gonna be in play. They're coming off hard from their highs, which means they're gonna offer a great buying opportunity soon. So what I recommend you do is you wait for that basing action, set some wide risks, and then buy some longer term call options on these stocks when you see the market starting to base. Now, if you're a little bit more advanced, you can start doing some scalpy day trades. What I recommend you do for that, if you're gonna be playing the options here, is that you wait till 10 o'clock in the afternoon to make your trade. Right now in the markets, we're seeing a lot of volatility in the nine to 9.45 range, where these stocks will gap up, they'll drop, they'll come back up, or they'll drop, then they'll just shoot right back to highs. It's really all over the place. So it's making risk reward trades really difficult right now. So with that being said, wait for those levels to form in the afternoon and then make your trades. If you're gonna be scalping, just wait to see where the high support and resistance levels are and then place your trade based on the trend that you see. What we have noticed is that a lot of those trends tend to continue after 10 o'clock. So you can really set some good risk levels here. As always guys, just be careful. Don't rush into any trades. Take smaller size as the market really isn't that hot right now. But I'm telling you, if you're watching the markets, if you're seeing all this red, it's okay. But you need to be prepared. So just to recap, Focus on the SPY, the Q, and the NASDAQ. Wait for those to base. And then once you see that happening, go heavy into Facebook, NVIDIA, Apple. These are gonna be the biggest trades where you can get some good risk reward on the call options. They've come pretty hard off their highs, but fundamentally, they're pretty good companies. So you can buy some month out options if you wanna be conservative and let those run. Or if you're a little bit more advanced, you can scalp some calls or maybe do some smaller term option calls on big support levels. All right, guys, I hope that was helpful for you. I hope you have a happy holidays. Be safe, trade great, and crush it. I'll see you guys later. Peace.